Hey everybody, Dr. Nelson here. Uh, this is a video about how to find the area of rectangles. So we're going to do two problems together, and then you have a chance to pause the video and try some problems on your own, and then at the end you can see how you did. Alright, so the process to get the area of a rectangle is actually fairly simple. Um, the formula is the area is the length times the width. So let's write that down here. So length times the width. Or you might see it written as A equals L times W. Alright, so let's just do a real quick, quick example here. Let's say this uh, rectangle we have here, let's say the length is say 5 inches and let's say the width is 2 inches well to find the area we have to do 5 times 2 so I'm going to write down A equals L times W and I'm going to substitute for the L the 5 and I'm going to substitute for the W the 2 and 5 times 2 gives us 10 now the label is important so because we have two dimensions we have a length and we have a width the label is going to be inches squared. All right, so the area of that rectangle would be 10 inches squared. So here we have another problem over here. It says determine the area of the shaded region. So we're really trying to find the area of the blue part of the, the shape. So notice we have two different uh, rectangles. We have a big rectangle, which I'm going to highlight right here. We have a big one. And then inside we have a smaller one right, right here. And the way we're going to find the area of the blue region is we're going to find the big area of, of the uh, rectangle and subtract the area of the smaller. All right, so if you notice, the length and width of the big is, is 8 by, sorry, 10, right? So 8 times 10 is 80. So the area of the large rectangle is 80 square feet. And now we're going to subtract the area of the small. So 3 times 5 is uh, 15. So the area of the small is 15 square feet. So 80 square feet take away 15 square feet will give us our answer of 65 square feet. And there it is. All right. So over here, this is the key thing you have to remember from this video. To find the area of a rectangle, you take the length, you multiply it by the width, and then the label is going to be squared inches or squared feet, uh, whatever you need to have for that one. All right. So why don't you pause the video and try the your turn now problems, and when you're done, hit the like, you can see how you did. Alright, good luck. Alright, welcome back. Let's say I do this practice problem. So, the directions say determine the area of the shape below. So if you notice, the shape consists of a rectangle and then two squares. So to find the area of the first, the big rectangle, I'm going to do area equals length times width. And I know the length is 20. And I know the width is 10. So 20 times uh, 10 is 200. So the area of the big rectangle is 200 square feet. But now we also have the two squares. So I know the length and width is actually the same because it's a square. So 4 times 4 is 16. So this is going to be 16 square feet which is going to be the same as over here, which is also 16 square feet, because it's the same image, right? So now to find the area of the whole thing, I need to add 16 plus 200 plus 16, and that would give us 232 square feet. And that's the answer that you're looking for. All right, how'd you do?